Damn, triple lightning storm. What do you do about it? What do you do about a triple lightning storm? Hello everyone, today we're going to be playing some Sky Strikers. I haven't played Strikers in quite a wee while and I feel like playing a blind second strategy and what better way to bring back Sky Strikers than bringing them into the Duelist Cup to see how blind second performs on the ladder. We're going to be doing a card for card at the end for anyone who hasn't seen Sky Strikers before or doesn't really know too much about it. I haven't explored it in a while, uh, but we do have quite a number of videos on this deck. We're not going to be playing the Furion version, at least not initially. We might switch over to it, but for now we're going to stick with this one. Just to see sort of how it goes and we'll sort of build it as we go along. Uh, again, I'm going to be playing live in the Duelist Cup here instead of doing recorded gameplay. I want, to, I want you guys to sort of see the process as well. Plus, a little bit more fun for me, you know, doing live commentary instead. So, we're just going to hop in. Again, we'll do a deck profile at the end. Uh, should we, you know, have some sort of success with it, that is. Uh, but if you do watch uh, or enjoy this style of gameplay, or uh, this style of content, or if you even just like the standard content that we do, which is the detailed deck breakdowns, the replays, the streams, the character duels, whatever it is that we do here that you like, you might as well subscribe for it. We're putting up a new video every single day. So you might as well. Helps me out. Helps you out. Doesn't cost you anything. Everybody wins. And with that, let's get into the gameplay. Already getting into game two, um, well one, sorry, game one. We're not going to play that. That we we did play a game there, but it was it, it was garbage, literally trash. Um, we're gonna we're gonna leave it for now. I'm a little bit afraid of I'm a little bit afraid of gamma. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little bit afraid of gamma. Okay, I'm gonna ash this. I may regret this. I may regret it. Okay, so we, okay, so no gamma, no gamma, no gamma. Okay, no call by either. No cross out. Love it. Love it. Oh, Agito. Um, Agito is actually kind of ass. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I'm just gonna maxi that. Agito is kind of ass. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Um, I guess it gives him, I guess it gives him Riser, if he's willing to special summon. He probably just normals, uh, normals the Yaman and search and then pass, I guess. You could win the Moonlight if you wanted to. Ooh, they got the Herald. The Vayner of the Herald. You don't know what I'm playing yet. Okay, so we're going to pitch Kelbeck. Kelbeck get Millen. Kelbeck get Millen. Ooh, milled a couple of good cards there. He milled Snow, that's really bad for us. Uh, Midora and Keldo? Are you having a giraffe? What the hell? No, so he's gonna be able to bounce back our entire freaking graveyard. That's unfortunate. Uh, Call by the Grave should help us a little bit at least. Got reinforcements as well. Um, you know, we got some stuff. He could, uh, I would summon Baron and pass here, right? Vayner is such a good card. I wish I actually had this card to put in my punk deck, my punk Ishizu deck. That'd be dope. Being able to just change this to a level 6, that's amazing. Probably a better normal summon than Zeaman for sure. I think he's just caught. He doesn't know whether or not he wants to go uh, into any more special summons. And I get it. I, I totally get it. We got the Fairy Tail Snow. Fairy Tail Snow gonna banish seven, summoning itself back out to the field. Interesting. Um. Okay, that eats up a lot. I'm, I'm way less scared now. I don't know what that was about. I think having Medora and Keldo and Grave was really beneficial. Um. Okay, he's gonna grab our Max C. Um, that gives him the Chaos Ruler. Okay. Chaos Ruler. Is he trying to deck me out? Is that the play? He's going to be very, very disappointed when he sees what I just drew. Agito, Necrophius, Kelbeck. Ooh, Kelbeck, Kelbeck, Kelbeck. And Keldo. God damn it. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. 
Okay, so he gets to add. What does he get to add? He, he chose not to add anything. That makes sense. Um, Agito gonna mill again. Uh, we're done with a bunch of spells. We haven't gotten rid of anything like integral, so I think we're fine still. He got rid of. Uh, I mean, there's snow in the grave, but that's. He's got two snow, two snow, two snow. Gonna activate snow. Gonna banish a number seven. All right. Don't forget, buddy. You've got. You've only got 19 cards in your deck, so you're not milling me out as fast as you're milling yourself out. And it banishes the almon from hand six from grave. Gonna bring out the snow. Um. Oh no. Gonna banish five from the top of the decks. So that is fine. Is this a deck out? Is he trying to deck me out? That would be unfortunate. I would not be happy about that. If that was if that is what was happening right now. <laughs> I would not be happy about that. And um, that's fine. Uh, I think we're still fine. Okay, so snow makes its way out. And then I think we just nib on this, right? Yeah, toggle on. Draw ray, nib. Nib, get nibbed. Nib, 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 nib. Get rid of it, burn it to the ground. Um. Um, I can't hit it with Droplet or Anger or Lightning Storm, actually, for that matter. Uh, I guess I'm going to play it in defense, then. Whatever. 4,500. God damn. God damn. Well, there you go. That's uh, that's Nibiru for you. That's why we play Nibiru. Um, <laughs> I don't know what to say. That's just, that it's, that's just the way it is. The way the cookie crumbles. We're going to go reinforcements of the army. Uh, do we even have a card left to add? Oh, we have a third ray. Alright. Alright, I see how it is. I guess we're going to normal ray. This card is destroyed by battle. Target a card your opponent controls and destroy it. That's fine. So I guess, I guess I'm going to give him the hamp by tributing the token. Do we complicate this or do we just beat his ass? <laughs> do we do we simply beat that ass? So when does he get this card back off of Zeke? Uh, during your opponent's next end phase. Okay, that's fine. I can deal with that. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna link these two off into Zeke. We got eleven cards left in deck. We do need to be careful of the possibility of a deck out. Although I think it would be very difficult for him to deck us out right now. So I'm not overly worried about it. I guess we could have stolen it off of this, but whatever. Gonna go engage. We definitely could have stolen it, actually, yeah. God, I'm gonna get laughed off the stage. I don't know what the freaking um, linkage combo for a game is. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know what the combo is. I do not know what the combo is. Um, we're gonna go Hayate. Okay, Hayate. Does it? Oh, it has to be summoned in defense. Alright. Has to be summoned in defense. Alright, I guess we go battle phase. Oh, because we have Rose banished, we can't even do it, right? Hayate. We're gonna swing. I'm actually not gonna use its effect. I'm not gonna use its effect. What I'm going to do is I'm going to linkage gonna send the Hayate. We're gonna summon Kigiri. Kigiri's gonna be kinda big. Actually, I don't have as many spells as I thought I did. I mean, 26 is still decently big. Well, 25 now. That's still kinda nice. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna grab our engage once more. Why not? Then we're gonna swing for 25. Bring him down to 4k. So that sort of puts us halfway there, right? That puts us halfway there. We're gonna go engage again. Gonna grab ourselves a shark cannon. I think shark cannon's gonna be real nice here. I feel like we've got 
tons of interruption. I think we should be totally fine. We do not have a lot of cards in, in deck, but I think that we're okay. I'm actually just going to keep Kigiri because I really don't even want to use Shizuku's effect. I'm not going to lie. I don't even want to use it. Um, we are just going to get set, set, set. And I'm actually going to call by the grave the Chaos Ruler. Just in case. Just in case. Because I, I sort of want to keep a, an open slot on my back row. Um, I think that's fine. And then we set this. Yeah, I think this is fine. This is fine. We get yeah, we're we're in control. We're definitely what what am, what am I even worried about? Why am I even I'm worried I'm worried because I'm at seven cards, right? End phase, that's fine. Zeke is gonna give him back the Kaiju. We're simply gonna steal it off of Widow Anchor and GG's. It's literally as easy as that. I'm sorry. It's 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 just that easy. It's just that easy. Yeah, yoink. In attack mode, into the battle phase, 28 to the face, and 25 for game. Easy dubs. And that's the power of Nibiru. <laughs> I know a lot of people aren't playing Nibiru at the minute because of, uh, because of gigantic sprite but like i haven't seen any of it in the duelist cup well i mean here and there but we we've, we've been crushing it there you go that's nib for you on to the next one already getting into game two here our official game two um oh cybers 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 cyber cyber cybers you know what? I don't want to be, uh, I don't want to think about it. I'm not even going to think about it. I'm not even going to think about it. You know what? You don't have Microcoder. You simply do not have Microcoder. You do not have Synet Codec. You do not have Synet Maining. Uh, you do not have Small World. You simply do not have these things. I refuse to believe it. Lingaribo, that's going to trigger your Parallel Exceed, I guess. Yep. Yep. Could have seen that one coming. Who would have seen that one coming? Who would have thunk it? Uh, Parallel Exceed's gonna summon another Exceed from deck. Slight problem, but I think we're fine. Uh, our boy, our boy is a bit of good comboing. Oh, the Math Mech version. All right, better get comboing off here. All right, we get ye, we get ye, mate. Circular. Circular to get circling. God damn. I guess I'll see you when the combo's over. Already, it's finally our turn. We are simply going to draw Lightning Storm. That's not Lightning Storm. All right. Um. Okay, he's gonna draw a card. That's whatever. We have Super Factorial. Sorry, we have called the degree for the Super Factorial. So I'm not even worried about it. We're literally not even worried about it. We're just gonna go Goblin. 
We're gonna draw. You can have a you can have a thousand life points. I'll help you recoup some of those lost life points, my friend. I will help you recoup some of those lost points. I'm going to normal. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna normal summon Ray. I think normal Ray is fine. Normal summon the Ray. Uh, we'll get Lincoln off into play Hayate, right? Probably the Hayate. If I were to guess, if I was a betting man, I would bet on the Hayate. And bring her out. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. So I guess we just, I guess we just battle fizz. We beat thine ass. Okay, not gonna super factorial. Interesting. 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 Gonna send the engage. Engage is nice. Uh, I've only got one spell engraved. That's not great. Um, I could linkage off my Hayate, but it does nothing. So we're not gonna do that because that would be stupid. Max C. Yeah, we'll linkage in response to that. That's fine. We'll do it. We'll do it. It's fine. It's whatever. It's cool. Because I don't want to call by the grave. I, I really want to keep the call by the grave for the super factorial. Absolutely. Uh, we're going to hit him with that Kagiri. Kagiri's going to grab us back the engage. We only have 17, uh, 1700 attack here, which is not big enough to get over the parallel exceed, unfortunately. But what are you going to do? It is the way it is. Ooh. See, that's not fun. Don't like that. Do not like that at all. Do not like that. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. It is fine. We will live. It is okay. We do need to give him at least one draw, though. We're gonna go Shizuku. It will be fine. We give him one. We set. We end. Now he flips up Factorial. We're gonna activate Shizuku first of all. There's the Factorial. Who would have seen that coming? Oh no! Literally as if, as if people aren't, as, as if people are dumb. Um, we'll banish the, uh, will we banish the diameter? Or the circular? I kind of like, <laughs> kind of want to, kind of want to banish the circular a little bit. I know, I appreciate that normally people banish the diameter, but I don't feel like we need to do that, because the Omni Negate doesn't do him any good, right? I would rather banish circular. Yeah, for sure. For sure. The Omni Negate doesn't do anything. We're not activating anything this turn. Um... He waited too long for that to be useful. I guess he, yeah, I guess he had plans. It makes sense. I get it. Um, Alan Bershin, for some reason, not in the Deco Talker Heat Soul Zone. Sure thing, buddy. Whatever you say. Sure thing, buddy. I guess I just. I mean, I guess we just grab Widowanger. I kind of want to, I'll be honest, I kind of want a shark cannon to get rid of one of these cards in Grave. I think I will. I think I will. One, two, three. Yeah, I think I'm going to grab shark cannon. I think I'm going to use it right away. I played it in the Imperm column. Did I? Please tell me that's not the Imperm column. Please tell me that's not the Imperm column. Oh, he negates it anyway. It's fine. It's all part of the plan. That was definitely the Imperm column. There was no way that wasn't, right? Um, it was. It was totally the Imperm column. <laughs> Oh, bad plays all around. 
bad plays all around. I'm getting cooked. I am getting absolutely cooked. Um, this is a problem. This is, in fact, a problem. Gonna normal the diameter. Whatever. That's fine. Whatever, dude. Whatever, dude. Um, he's probably gonna link off in the access code. Probably. Tributing itself. Makes sense, makes sense. I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Gonna special summon a math mech monster. Bringing out the multiplication. Ooh. I mean, so long as Deco Talker Heat Soul is here. I guess technically he could access code here, right? <laughs> Nobody needs to tell him that though. Oh no, he knew! He knew! There's no way! I have to I have to imperm this. And then I lose anyway, because he's just gonna Omega! And then I lose, sorry, not Omega, Sigma! And then I... <laughs> and then he just Sigmas for a game! Oh no! <laughs> Sigma for game! Oh dear, what a time to be alive. What a time to be alive. God damn. We're gonna take a million damage from this. Yep, there it is, 9k. Oh my god. Well played. Well, well played. GG's. Full transparency. We're, uh, we're throwing Fury on in. Already getting into game three. Oh, we, no, there's no way we're against another punk matchup. We've got another Imperial. This is so sad. This is so sad. We're gonna Foxy Tomb, we got nothing. We're gonna turn our toggle off. That's fine, they're gonna ditch snow. Snow? They're gonna deer note. Um, that's fine. Okay. That's fine. Yep. Chaos Ruler, get Millen. Chaos Ruler, get Millen. So I think we're going to turn our toggle back on as soon as he summons the zombie vampire. Once he summons the zombie vampire, and then going to Nibiru. Yep, there's a right, right in. Interesting. Okay, he's actually playing Light Sworn this time. That's pretty good. I like the Light Sworn. I am liking the Light Sworn. Gonna go Charge of the Light Brigade, dropping another bunch of cards here to grab a Light Sworn monster from the deck. Grabbing a right in. Triggering Wolf and Kelbeck. Wolf and Kelbeck are absolutely going to start gaming. No tuners on board. Has he normal summon? I'm pretty sure he normal summons the Almond, right? He did. Um, we dropped a couple of cards. Nothing too useful, unfortunately. But it's fine, he's got a Necrofierce Engrave. That is kind of unfortunate, I'm not gonna lie. That is kind of unfortunate. Okay, Zombie Vampire. Now we're hitting him. We're hitting him. We're hitting him with the noob. Oh, this guy's gonna have 3100 defense. That is, that is unfortunate. 3100 defense. Gonna nib it up. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna play you in attack. Is it? No, defense will do. Defense is fine. Defense is fine. 3100. 3100. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. We got solar recharge. God damn, pot agreed. Dropping the right in, drawing two, milling two. What the hell was that? What the hell did you just say to me? Yo. It's like Grand Maju, but bad. Awesome, I love it. <laughs> it's literally Grand Maju, but bad. <laughs> Gonna banish Necroface. Ah, oh, and Giant Rex. Oof. Man, it sucks to be us right now. I'm not gonna lie. 
It sucks to be us. Giant Rex. We got the Necro Fierce. We're probably gonna get Snow flipping our Nib Fierce down, I guess. Look at Haim. Haim's just gonna bounce something back. That's whatever. Stopping themselves from decking out. Okay, 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 okay. What do we got? How many cards we got left in deck? We got 30. We got 30. Snow, yep, Snow is gonna get flipping. Gonna get flipping. Uh, we don't care too much about that. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. We're, we're confident. We got it. We still, uh, we still got some cards. I would like to have more cards, but, you know, we still have cards. Um, don't really like that we banished these two, but it's okay. It's fine. Oh no, stop it! Strip <laughs> I banished both my engages! God damn! Why is this guy such a jerk? Paying 37 to summon out Destrudo as a level 3. 3, 4, and 4. That's uh, that's the Psychic End Punisher if you're ballsy. That is the Psychic End Punisher if you got some Kahunes. And it's not even a terrible play considering the life point difference. I'm gonna be real. Pay 1,000, banish the token, banish the noob. It's not bad. Uh, that's definitely a play. Brings him the 27 if he does that. Okay, no, just gonna link two off into the Barricade, Bor Barricade Borg Blocker. Protect the field spell or continuous spell. Okay, Chaos Ruler banishing two from Grave to summon itself back to the field. Um, probably just looking to set up a mask, potentially? Mask Arena? I don't know. Has he got a way to summon out another tuner? I don't think he does. I could be wrong though. But I don't think he does. I'ma be real with you, Chief. We'll see. Okay, linking for four into the bomber. This guy's a freaking Chad, and then Snow into the bomber zone, popping the whole field. Love it. This guy's got plays. This guy's got all kinds of plays. We do have, uh, we do have the droplet though, so we're not too worried about it. Oh, he's not gonna get bombing. Okay, that makes sense. That's smart. It's, he's not gonna get bombing. Gonna go do Garus. Do Garus. Do Garus draw two. Or Monster Reborn, I guess. Do Garus, Monster Reborn. Yeah. Skip your next main phase one. Okay. Gonna bring out Doomsday Horror. No. No. There's no shot. There's no shot. We're about to get decked out. There is absolutely zero way that this is happening right now. There is zero way that this is happening right now. Double Necroface. Oh my god. Gonna banish another 10 cards from the top of my deck. I now have five cards in my deck. I have five cards left. I have zero. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? All right. Um, we were forced to go first. Which isn't a good look for us. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see if we can make it work. This, out of all of the hands that we could have had going first, this is among the better ones. Right? 
Um, if this card sent to the graveyard by a card effect, you're not really all that useful. Okay, we're gonna go to Coliseum. Coliseum, it's gonna grab us um, a little uh, Regulus. That is fine. We're gonna go Ray. Yo, hang on. Who said anything about playing Furions? Okay. We could we could go mask. But like, is that a good play? <laughs> I think so. Probably not. Probably not. If I were to guess, if I were to guess, probably not. We're gonna go Hayate off of Ray. Whatever. All right, Hayate off of Ray. That's fine. Then we go with Shizuku off of Ray. I mean, having Rose here is actually a bit of a bad thing, but whatever. It's fine. Um, then we're going to activate Regulus. We're going to summon Regulus. And we're just going to try to not be sad, right? That's the plan. That is the plan. 1600 defense. We're just going to try to not be sad. Um, grand. And fears we get to search. This guy's playing a 60 card deck. He's playing 60 cards. It's either really good or really bad. Right? We're either going to get absolutely steamrolled or this is going to be a playable game. We'll just have to wait and see. Okay, droplet. Dropping the lit. Infernoids! Okay, so he's got Unaku. Okay, just dropping the Unaku. Okay. Um. Okay. Ah, uh, I mean, you know, Regulus getting negated, taking two cards out of his hand? Sure. That's, you know, I've seen worse trades. I've seen worse trades. That's fine. Um, I really wish Mask could use Link Monsters. I think Mask is just a bad card. I'm pretty sure people keep on telling me to take it out. Again, I'm really rusty with, with, with... I smell shenanigans. Let's see. Yeah, he's gonna have to magical mallet the whole hand if he wants to get something out of it. Yep. All the way. Balls deep. Let's see what you got. Did you get something? There's no way he hits grass off this, right? There's no way. Functionally, scientifically impossible. There's no way! There's actually no way. You know what? I'm kinda glad he did. Otherwise, this would have been a steel game. But we're about to get our shit rocked, man! We're about to get our fucking shit rocked! God damn! Just one game! The meta is just way too terrible for us right now. We're gonna wipe out my Shizuku? No, you're gonna wipe out the back row. Alright. I guess that makes sense. 25 cards in deck. He, like, banished almost all spells, though. So he doesn't have that many Infernoids in Grave, which is fine. He can maybe do one or two summons, right? He's gonna banish three. How many does he have left? So, so he's got one, two, three... He's got three left. On summon, you're gonna destroy all of our monsters on the field. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That triggers Ray. You can negate a spell or a trap, not a monster effect. Okay, so we're gonna go Ray in defense, that's fine. He can summon, he's got like what, four? One, two, three. He's got three, so he can summon like Siestas and Snow. And then he has to pass, right? So he's gonna go Snow. That's fine, Snow is gonna target our 
Ray. We're gonna activate Ray, tribute it to summon out Kiana. Kiana will lock up Onaku for the turn. It's gonna keep it. Or don't target. Alright. Weird you would give me that freedom. Okay, gonna link it off into the Moon Maiden. Okay. Why? Just so you can snow again, I guess? Um, I guess you can snow again into like a Link 2. You can go into Lina. Lina, grab Rose. Link climb. Good. Definitely possible. You definitely could do that. Not activating Snow's effect. Interesting. I feel to see the advantage that not activating Snow gives. I feel like Snow targeting and forcing Ray to use its effect is like really basic logic here. I feel like he goes into Lina, Lina grab, Rose, then Lina plus Rose, yeah, into probably Unicorn. Or something like that. Or maybe Celine. Maybe even into Celine. That's also an option. You can still summon Siatsimus from the Grieve. Siatsimus, or whatever the hell the thing's name is. Man, I love Infernoids. They're so cool. Yep, there's Selene. Okay, I sort of figured Selene would be coming out, to be honest with you. Um, I do need to be aware of Goddess. Um, but I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Selene, pay three counters. We're gonna resurrect the Snow. Or the Artemis, actually. Or maybe even... Lina's also a spellcaster. So you could bring back Lina, actually. Or Snow. Snow's fine. Snow's fine. Okay, now we're gonna go... Now we're gonna go Fairy Tail. Okay. I knew that they had to do it eventually, right? They had to. So if we want to get any advantage out of this, we go Kiana. Kiana locks up Unaku for the turn. Kind of. Kind of. Uh, I mean, not, not like, honestly, not really. Because <laughs> he just links it off and then resummons it, right? I'm pretty sure, um, I'm pretty sure you can just do that. Goddamn, Infernoids are so goddamn cool! Why am I getting game bombs? Okay, into... Zero Boros. Just too much for a card. Into the battle phase. Snow coming out. Snow banishes another seven cards. Oh my god, that's game! Man, Sky Strikers is simply way too slow. Oh no, it's not. Oh, uh, it, it's it is game. It's not. Why not? What? Huh? Why not? Why didn't he attack? Was there something preventing him? There's probably an effect somewhere that stopped that, right? I'm not stupid, right? I'm gonna go Arspius. Okay, Unaku, okay, great. I, I was really wanting him to do that. Yeah, he tributes off the snow. He's got five cards left in Grave. Um, that's fine. You get negated or banished, whatever. Bye bye Get out of here. Um, that doesn't make me sad, does it? It does. I don't think it does. I think we're, I don't think we're sad. I think we're fine. We're gonna go Rose. 
Okay, we're not sad. We're, we're not. Okay, we're gonna go Rose into Hayate. We've got plays. We might actually be fine here. I don't know why he didn't attack with the Zero Boros. There must have been a reason. Um, we don't even have three spells in Grave. That's just sadness. Um, that's fine, though. We're gonna go Linkage. Because I feel like I'm gonna need as much advantage as I can get here. Or maybe do a Shark Cannon. Do I have Shark Cannon? We can grab Shark Cannon at the end of the turn off of Shizuku, right? Yeah, let's do that. We can't really do um, multi-roll because we have nothing to send off of it. So we'll grab Engage. We just want to do some damage. Some big deeps, big deeps. Um, I guess we just swing. Swing for Hayate. Hayate, activate. What are we going to pitch? What are we going to pitch? Um, send something to Grave. Send Hornet, I guess, to, to Grave. Whatever. It's just a name. Now we're going to go mult, uh, Linkage, sorry. Linkage is going to drop our Hayate. We're going to summon out Kigiri. Kigiri is going to be... It's not that big, actually. It's going to be like 1800 at most. Oh, because it gets boosted by the thing, actually. It's it's actually significantly larger than that. We do 3k. We can't linkage into anything else that's good. We can't OTK this turn, so we can't. But we can inflict a medial 2900. Now with multi-roll engrave and the Hornet drones, that gives us our third spells, which means engage will grab us um, Widow Anchor, as well as drawing a card. Nice. We're gonna draw a card. Drawn the droplet. What a what a draw. God damn. Then we go Shizuku. Uh, Shizuku at the end. Phase is gonna grab us the Shark Cannon. Shark Cannon gonna banish Snow and Profit. I think we I think we actually win this one. Toggle on. Shizuku grabs us Shark Cannon. Um, and then we activate Shark Cannon. Gonna banish the snow. And I don't really think it has anything else to do here. We're not gonna summon at the R field. We, we just want rid of it. He would have to top deck like a freaking god to get out of this situation. Nothing in his graveyard is playable by itself. He would have to draw like the best card in the game. Honestly. He really would. I don't even know what he could possibly draw. There you go. We got one. Nice. Alrighty, now this is normally the part where I would do a deck profile, but that was rough. I, I feel like I don't even want to present this guy as, as a finished deck because, I don't know. This is pretty much how we were playing it in the past. However, it just felt supremely weak. It really did. And I don't think this deck is actually any weaker. It's the fact that the metagame around it is so much goddamn faster. When you manage a Shizu and Punk and Sprites and all of these decks that just move a million miles a minute. And the best bit about this deck, honestly, was Nibiru. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> and even it wasn't winning us the games. Um... So, I mean, here's a list. If you want uh, a more detailed breakdown in Sky Strikers, you can check out our last video on it. We did it probably a wee while ago at this point. Um, I don't feel like I want to present this as a finished list. I want to work on this a little bit more because it just didn't feel that great. And it could just be a case of Sky Strikers. It's getting left in the dust. It's just really slow. And I don't think there's any fix in that. I think it is just slow. That's just how it works. But again, that's my thoughts on the deck. There's the gameplay to back it up. Maybe I'm terrible at the game. If you see misplays that I made, I no doubt you will because I am rather rusty with the strategy. Again, I haven't played it in quite a long time. Um, if you see misplays, anything you want to point out, laugh at, help with, whatever, leave it in the comments or hop into the Discord. Subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you in the next one.